Hello beautiful people. Today's video is going to be on how to detach from the outcome of whatever we're trying to manifest. How to detach from the outcome and trust the universe. So what does it mean to say, you know, we're attached to an outcome? Well, if you're anything like I have been in my life is you want to control what the outcome is. You know, you, you, this, you want this particular thing and the more you want it, it's like there's resistance there. And the more you resist, the more the issue, the, the circumstance you don't want to be in uh, is, going to, um, is going to persist. So um, if there's controlling energy behind whatever actions you're taking, whatever manifestations you're trying to make happen, um, they're not going to materialize the way you want them to. So um, how, do you, how do you deal with that? How do you actually let go of this attachment um, to the outcome that you want? Well, there's a couple of uh, quotes that I just wanted to share with you real quick today that um, have, have helped me. The first one is from Abraham Hicks, and it says, the reason that you want every single thing you want is because you think it will make you feel really good when you get there. But if you don't feel really good on your way there, you can't get there. You have to be satisfied with what is while you're reaching for more. So you have to be satisfied with what is before reaching for more. So if you're not in a place in your mindset where you're satisfied with the way things are right now, you're secure in, in who you are, you feel good, you feel, um, you know, loved, you feel, you know, and that's something you can give to yourself. You feel validated, you feel good, you feel okay with the way things are because you know who you are and you know your worth. If you don't feel that way, um, it, it's, it's, it's not going to happen. It's all about the energy, right? So if you don't have that energy, you know, that's the first step. You've got to, you've got to get that. Um, you know, we have to deal with our resistance before we can deal with anything else. So, so that's really your first step in manifesting is take the time to get in the right mindset. Whether that's days, weeks, months, I don't know, because I don't know your story, but you've got to take the time and it's okay to take the time. You have to be able to be okay with what is before reaching for more. So um, the next quote that I have, sorry about my notes here, um, is from um, Gabrielle Bernstein, who wrote a few books, of course, um, Super Attractor, I think this is from Super Attractor. The universe responds when you let go and welcome divine guidance when there is controlling energy behind your actions, you won't receive the outcome you truly want. The key to attract your desires is to release them. So how hard are you holding on to this desire? Whatever it is you're trying to manifest, whether it be a job, whether it be you know, uh, money manifestation, whether it be a relationship, how hard are you holding on to that? Is your actions and your manifestation meant to just control a situation? Um, something to think about. So one thing that has helped me um, is something that I say every day, and this is kind of like my mantra, or you could think of it as a prayer, um, or what have you, as part of your affirmations or um, meditation. Uh, this is also from Gabriel Bernstein, and it says, I surrender this attachment to allow the universe to show me where to go and what to do. So um, if you feel that you are uh, too attached or attached at all to the outcome, because if you think about it, 
when th when do things happen? When do really good things happen? It's like when we when we're not expecting it, when we don't care, when we're thinking about other things, when we're busy over here. All of a sudden, you hear about it with, um, for example, um, pregnancy, right? People, you hear the story about people trying to have a baby, and um, once they give up, that's when it happens. Or when you weren't looking for that relationship, there it is, you know. Um, so, so incorporate, you know, this this mantra, this prayer of surrender. Um, once you let go of that you'll find that manifesting whatever is you desire, um, that's the only time that it's really possible. So let go of control. You, we, we don't have control, right? Um, you have to trust in the universe, God, whatever source, whatever you wanna call it. You have to trust in that and not try and control everything. You can't control you have to be able to not, you have to get to a point where circumstances don't matter. What the problem is in front of you doesn't matter because you're okay. You know, you're good either way. Once you get to that spot, you'll find that you can manifest anything you desire. All right, well, I hope that was helpful and um, I'll see you next time.